I think of House as a very emotional character. The thing is, though, that it's a, all a question of revelation, how much of it he shows to people. And in that scene at the end of season four, where he actually betrays his, his need for love and friendship and a place in the world, he's actually doing it in the environment of a, a sort of hallucination, where he's in a, a kind of netherworld, crossing the river Styx to Hades, and he then makes the decision to go back and, and embrace life. But all of that happens out of the public view. It's not something he'd ever show to anybody. And when season five starts, he's kind of drawn up or down the shutters. Do shutters come down or up? I don't know, Which, whichever, he's done that. Okay. Um, and he's tried to conceal how much that all of that meant to him and means to him. In season four, we would actually get, you know, each episode script all turned to the last page to see which character gets fired. And then breathe a sigh of relief that it wasn't us and start from the beginning. I knew, like Cal did and Livy did, that we would that we were contracted for nine. So we knew that we were going to be in the final group of five. And at, really, we, there were, I think, three or four episodes there when it was just the five of us vying for it. And we, had, we really didn't know. Now that the competition is over of who's staying and who's going, and there was a lot of closure at the end of um, season four, you see a lot more of the dynamic between the the three uh, new team members and all the you know the three older team members and then the the staple of the hospital administration and and Robert Sean Leonard's character that all meshes together a lot more everyone has a particular role to play and sometimes those roles get disrupted because we are still the three new characters on the show so that's a lot of fun I think you'll uh, you'll definitely have the chance to see a little more of that I think they're gonna delve into not only Foreman's but I think uh, you know everyone's lives a little bit I have noticed that we were already in episode five or six and I've noticed they've really they have delved deeper I think with the other characters than they normally do not in any way at any expense of of house because that is so the core and so the engine that makes the show run obviously the way that they left off with house and wilson they're going to delve into that there's definitely going to be some damage you know to their relationship for my character there, there have been some real sort of consistent explorations along the way which is not easy to achieve with it now it's a big cast it's nine of us and you know it's about the medicine it's about him and that's the show and that's what's so great about it but I think it's you know they really have for, for all of us we seem to sort of get our moment to really sort of go a little bit deeper in terms of Foreman I think they're gonna get more into his personal life um, who knows if there's a love possibility I would say the odds of house finding happiness long <laughs> never long to infinite